Mamalusi Kibaki Hospital in Nairobi is set to be elevated to a level 5 health facility in a bid to decongest Kenyatta National Hospital and Mbagavi Hospital in the wake of the COVID-19 pandemic. Speaking during the handover of personal protective equipment to healthcare workers at the Mamalusi Kibaki Hospital, Nairobi Metropolitan Services Director General Mohamed Badi said the work which will kick off on Monday will see the hospital equipped with 120 isolation bed capacity and an 18 ICU bed facility. Health workers at the Mama Lucy Kibaki Hospital in Nairobi is the latest batch to receive personal protective equipment courtesy of COVID-19 Response Fund in partnership with Equity Group Foundation. The consignment consists of full gears and is projected to serve 400 workers for a period of 15 months. So that private-public partnership, I want on to call on the government to really do more because we understand now society much better because we have learned a lot of lessons, particularly on managing in uncertain times. The PPE is manufactured by Kenya Association of Manufacturers with the help of COVID-19 health technical team are said to have met the required quality standards and are projected to reduce the cost of procuring PPEs for health workers in the country. Most of them were not up to standard and they have worked back and forth wearing all those PPEs and making sure that the quality is good, reading about what is the best practice. So I can assure my fellow colleagues uh, from Mamalusi that yes, we have gone through the process of making sure that it's quality and we take responsibility for anything that is not up to quality. We have continued to work with the local manufacturers and when we started a number of things were not being produced locally, but today out of all the PPE items, I think the only one left, the machines are coming into the country and soon even N95s will be procured locally. <laughs> Nairobi Metropolitan Service Director General Major General Mohamed Badi while receiving the donation at the facility which has an isolation center for COVID-19 said the improvement of the status of health facilities in the county will see Mamalusi Hospital host a 120 isolation bed capacity and an 18 ICU bed facility. Major General Bad. Out of our programs in NMS, Mamalusi Hospital uh, will be elevated to level 5 hospital and the work will start coming Monday. He says in the next 60 days, 24 health facilities will have been constructed and upgraded in nine informal settlements in a bid to aid in isolation and treatment of COVID-19. Uh, groundwork has started. We'll officially open th we will officially uh, ground break on Monday. The three sites and the other 24 will continue work from Monday. So come 60 days, we should be able to see the new facilities up uh, uh, and running. Out of over 3,000 health workers in Nairobi County, 210 have been infected with COVID-19 in line of duty. For a while now, healthcare workers have decried of shortage of PPEs, but the government now says that with the new partnership, such cases may be a thing of the past as it struggles to ensure that the market does not run short of supply. Kamchemenza for Channel 1 News at the Mamalusi Kibaki Hospital, Nairobi.